It just you know, sort of uh, you turn back the pages or whatever. You know, so. Nostalgia, but at the same time, I think uh, I think the kids nowadays deserve to hear mm. what the Great Society was all about. Thirty years, responsible. The count, the count, the count. How does it feel to bring back Great Society after 30 years? I mean, there was so yes. much to the band than just you, you know, just us, our faces. I mean, it was about the music, it was about, uh, like you used to call it, the institution of the Great Society. Boy, oh boy. <laughs> I started off as a fan of the band. And uh, because I was like I was like really young and back back then, this was the only music. Australian uh. music was the only music I really connected with. Yeah. So and me and my group of friends, we were fans of the band, and we would be the guys right in front dancing. And if a speaker needed to be carried, we would be the first guys to go and carry a speaker and all that. So as a young boy, so I could hear this band playing. So I could hear every day what music? Wow. So. I just started the band, but very raw at the time. I just started playing also. But um, then I went to a neighbor's house. Then I saw Lou. I saw the other guys. I think Danny. Then AJ. I think Sam was on the drums. Then I took a tape recorder with me and I asked for Lou's permission, with the guy's permission, if I could record and sit there. So I did that. So that's how, you know. Yeah, I don't know where I kept the tape, but Lou told me that <laughs> uh, if I can find that tape, then you'll be rewarded. Yes, financially. Yes. <laughs> uh, early years, I mean, like, there was uh, hardly any expertise musically. So that, that's what that's what I felt. But uh, now, as time goes by, so we're sort of getting things much more meaningful, I should say, mm. because with the you know, experience over the years and also like Rudy with the technical know-how how to handle the, you know, the mixer and amps and guitars, whatever it is. But yeah, for Mujao, I'm the same old dog, so I, you know, <laughs> I don't think anything. I'll just pluck in there, it's making noise. Yeah, drrrr and yap, I mean, like for me, I'm the happiest dog in town. If they're able to sit on and listen to the lyric of a Great Society song, the lyric that Lou, Lou wrote, I think you, it's still relevant today and you can still yeah. connect with whatever is happening with, happening yeah. with, with the, the lyric today. and with the world today. You know? Absolutely. Yeah. So playing at the Cherry Blossom Festival after so many years, what does that mean to you? I feel that we are blessed to be still around <coughs> and be, we are being able to make music. A lot of our contemporaries have passed away. Band mates, like, you know, yeah. A lot of bands have gone. You know, I feel that we are blessed that we are still around, still able to do this. It's a blessing for us. Yes. I think everything works out for the best. So it's really nice that we're getting to play at this like a nice large stage with a, where a large audience is going to be there as the yeah. first as the first gig of the reunion. And I'm really looking forward also to see how many of our old fans are going to be in the crowd singing, yeah, singing be nice, from yeah. Hawaii and from. Maybe from Nagaland. So I'll miss being in the audience and watching these guys. <laughs> the, these guys, these yeah. guys play, and I'll be there singing all the songs, singing my heart out to all the to all the songs. That's that's what I I'll miss because starting from Bert, like all these drum, all the great side drummers were my heroes. Starting from Bert, then came then came Sam. I remember I was a young kid, and Sam Sam used to drive a taxi by day and play drums at night. And Rudy took me to one show where I first saw Sam. And since then, like Sam used to park his car in Five Brigade just opposite Mum's house, and I sit on there and like, hey man, that's a great city drummer, you know that kind of thing. From being a fan of the band to like being able to play with them, so I would rather sit on and listen to the guys play, <laughs> listen to the guys that's play. Yeah. Don't forget to buy your tickets. Come and check out the Great Society. Yes. Be with the Great Society. Yes. Loneliness is my good friend I've learned to smile when I feel sad When I see good times turn on bad I'm lonely, I'm lonely.